Week Garden Grove High School students take the gold at a state science competition. Vanessa Pang will show us who the winners are and how they did it. It's a windmill made with no trespassing signs, scrap metal, and two pizza pants. It took first place at the state's Mesa, Math, Engineering, Science Achievement, Wind Energy Challenge Competition. The construction men are Garden Grove High School student Stephen Chow, who's project manager, Scott Wynn, the writer, and Kaylin Zaluzic, the builder. They told us how the winning device was made. Everything just didn't pop into our head all at once. We first started off with a regular windmill kit, which was literally like sticks and twigs. With each competition, we look at new windmills, new designs, get new ideas, and just keep improving off of that. But it's also team dynamics. These guys have spent hours building science projects together for three years. Scott Wynn says they are like family. We've been through pretty much every single emotions, every dispute. We kind of got over the obstacles that like any team could ever face. So I'm pretty sure we're closer than like any other team like out there. During the competition, the team's device has to produce electricity, pull a toy vehicle, and lift the heaviest mass, all through wind power. And it's not an easy task. We basically work on this project every week, yeah. especially near a competition, a lot of time together. I'm proud of them. I'm, I'm amazed at the amount of dedication that they put into it. I don't think I could have done that as a high school student. They'll be competing in the national competition June 25th through the 27th at the University of Colorado. We wish them luck. This is Vanessa Ping reporting. The Garden Grove High School team also took second place at the annual Popsicle Stick Bridge Competition at the LA California Science Center in February.